Hello, this video is a quick overview of the Tiny MCE Advanced Editor plugin for WordPress. If you are a WordPress user, you'll already be familiar with the Posts and Pages editor. Now, that editor is powered by Tiny MCE. Tiny MCE being an open source JavaScript, what you see is what you get editor. So WordPress uses it by default. I'm guessing that uh, Drupal and Joomla and any other CMS probably uses it as well, although I'm not certain, I'm just speculating. But WordPress definitely uses it. And the plugin that I want to show you is one which adds advanced functionality to the MCE editor. And there's a few reasons why you might want to do that. Um, I'll, I'll be telling you about a problem I had in a second and how this plugin solved it for me. If we take a look at the standard WordPress editor, you can see that you've got add media, you've got bold, italic, strike through, bullets, numbering, quotes, paragraph tags, underline, etc, etc. That's all well and good, but it may be that you want to add um, some more options to that menu. And if I can draw your attention to my cursor, you can see that I'm hovering over these additional buttons that have appeared on top of uh, the, the editing toolbar. So it's a little bit like Microsoft Word document. So you've got all these additional options and it might be that you might want to do some extra uh, formatting without having to go into the source code and do it manually. So this is great. It's good for if you're providing web design services to clients then this can be very useful because it, it can remove a lot of headaches so it's a very good plugin and the reason I installed it was initially because I found that when I switched between the source code editor and the visual editor WordPress was stripping out my paragraph tags and my line break tags which was a problem because as you can see I've got my um, my lines of text nicely spaced out but when I used to, when I'd go into the source code maybe to add some paste in some HTML or add some HTML attributes like no follow I'd go back to the visual editor and all of this text would be one giant paragraph so basically all the lines run on there'd be no uh, no, no paragraph tags no separation it looked horrible and it got on my nerves and uh, I searched online typing in stuff like WordPress strips out HTML, WordPress removing formatting tags, WordPress deleting HTML attributes, loads of posts all over the web, people saying to add stuff to functions.php, try this, try that, I tried this and I tried that, didn't work, so I thought well I've heard about this um, tiny MCE advanced editor, I'll give that a go. So I installed it, tiny MCE advanced. So I've installed that, so you can, you can search the WordPress repository by clicking the add new button or you can download it manually and install it that way. And once you've added the plugin, if you go to settings and then tiny MCE advanced, you'll be given some options one of which is a checkbox which says stop removing the paragraph and break tags when saving and show them in the text editor so I've checked that now so that means that when I switch between the, the, the visual editor and the text editor I don't have that problem anymore and it has it has been brilliant I'm really pleased about this it's just I don't like to install loads and loads of plugins so if you want to check it out, go to tinymce.com slash try it slash basic dot php or look, look in the description of this video and you can play around live so you can see how things work and uh, what to expect and uh, if the Tiny MCE Advanced Editor is useful let me know, share any ideas or tips with me. I, I just hope that they keep it updated because plugins which are no longer compatible with the latest version of WordPress can break or become a security issue. So that's my only concern. But thanks for watching and uh, comment below. Cheers. Bye.